what do you understand when we say cell proliferation? This means cell increases in number. And this increase in number is the result of cell division. Let's say this is a cell, it undergoes single event of cell division. As a result, two cells are formed. The most important event which happens during cell division is DNA replication. Without this cell proliferation is impossible. We all know that DNA is made up of nucleotides namely adenine, guanine, cytosine, and thymine. These nucleotides are synthesized cell. Now suppose, a cell is not able to synthesize these nucleotides. What will happen? There will be no DNA formation, hence no DNA replication, and this will be fatal for the cell. Let's have an overview of how these nucleotides are synthesized in mammalian cells. In the mammalian cells, there are two main pathways of the nucleotide synthesis. These are de novo synthesis pathway and the salvage pathway. De novo synthesis pathway. De novo means starting from the beginning. In this pathway, nucleotides formation begins with simple precursor compounds. Through a series of steps, this pathway leads to the formation of nucleotides that finally forms DNA. At the initial step of de novo pathway, tetrahydrofolate is essentially required. Without tetrahydrofolate this pathway cannot proceed. Tetrahydrofolate is made from dihydrofolate. And this reaction is catalyzed by the enzyme dihydrofolate reductase. If formation of tetrahydrofolate is blocked somehow, synthesis of nucleotides by de novo pathway will automatically fail. One such drug that inhibits formation of tetrahydrofolate is aminopterin. Aminopterin is an enzyme inhibitor. It competes for the folate binding site of the enzyme dihydrofolate reductase and thus blocks tetrahydrofolate synthesis. Overall, we can say that aminopterin blocks the de novo pathway of nucleotide synthesis. Now let's come to the second pathway, the salvage pathway. Term salvage is derived from Latin which means to save or retrieve. This pathway recycles free bases and nucleosides inside the cell and form nucleotides. In other words, this pathway recovers preformed bases and form nucleotides by reconnecting them. The salvage pathway involves two key enzymes abbreviated as HGPRT and TK. HGPRT stands for hyposanthine guanine phosphoribosyltransferase. This enzyme catalyzes the formation of nucleotides from hyposanthine and guanine. Second enzyme TK stands for thymidine kinase. This enzyme converts thymidine into corresponding nucleotide. If there is any mutation in the genes producing either of these two key enzymes, salvage pathway will be blocked. This is because the mutation will make these enzymes non-functional. So, we now understand that HGPRT is a key enzyme in the formation of nucleotides by the salvage pathway.